It was just before the state of emergency, the, the, state, uh, the, the, coup, the coup attempt process, where I, de I decided to stand uh, next to a pro-Kurdish daily. Uh, they launched a campaign on 3rd of May, World Press Freedom Day, and uh, invite many intellectuals, journalists to, to stand as, as a symbolic manner at the editorial desk. But it was enough for Turkish judiciary to indict me. Uh, of course, it was, they, they tried to make a, a first example of, for jailing in the scoop of this campaign and to stop this campaign by jailing three of journalists. So I found myself <laughs> late afternoon when I went by my, myself to the prosecutor office uh, uh, at the city center of Istanbul in a, in a, in a prison. So I was kept uh, 10 days uh, w waiting for my indictment. And I should say that it was uh, the time where international and national civil society organization pressure was uh, important and taken into account at the same time. So thanks to th this wonderful uh, solidarity movement, I was really spending trial uh, 10 days later on. Yeah. And uh, Tom, you probably know this moment. I mean, how has the State Department under the previous administration, where has it been successful in Turkey? Part of what I'd really like to talk about is, you know, what can we come up with that we haven't thought of before? So if we can learn a little bit from you about the past and what actually worked to pressure Turkey, that I think that would be well, instructive has been a particularly tough case just because there's so much going on, um, including the situation inside Turkey, the crackdown after the coup, the violence uh, in the Kurdish areas, but also um, the war in Syria, and, and which has placed Turkey in a very critical position in terms of everything that we are trying to do as a country in Syria. Um, I can't think of a place where um, the considerations in U.S. policy are more complicated right now, um, and that was certainly the case under the Obama administration. Um, I still think even, even under those very complicated circumstances, the fact that the United States and other countries are willing to speak out even occasionally about cases mm -hmm. of journalists being imprisoned or newspapers shut down makes a difference. 